is a big cleanup job, even for a bunch of maintenance bots like us. Uh, one more, ma'am? Please don't hurt us! Those humans were afraid of me. Can you blame them? After all, we trashed half their city. I believe the Decepticons did most of the trashing. Well, I liked it better when we were heroes. We're still heroes, Bulkhead. We just have to remind them. Now let's all get back to work. Hey, where's Bumblebee? Isn't he supposed to be helping too? Isaac Sumdax office, please hold. Isaac Sumdax office, please hold. Isaac Sumdax office, uh, no. Professor Sumdax still hasn't returned from his extended vacation. Of course someone's running a company. Someone very capable. Ah, no wonder my dad acted so crazy. How do you do this? Miss Sumdak, as chairman of your board of directors, I've been going over the books, and I see you're still wasting valuable resources searching for your missing father. Isn't it time that you just accepted the fact that he's... No! He's my dad, and if I were missing, he'd do the same for me. Young lady, there's no room for sentiment in business. A mere child can't be entrusted to make sound decisions for this company. This company's name is still Sumdak, so until I find my dad, I'm staying right here, and there's nothing you can do about it! <sighs> Hold my calls. I need a break. Okay, boss lady. But you might want to take a look at this. All eyes are on the sky as a mysterious unidentified object from space has entered Earth's atmosphere, heading straight for downtown Detroit. Did you guys see that? It's kind of hard to miss. We better look into it. Transform and roll out! Let us handle this. Oh, oh, what? So you can wreck the other half of the city? I don't think so. Huh? Robots. Why did it have to be robots? Ultra Magnus, sir. Welcome to Earth, Commander. It's an honor. Jazz, set up a force shield to quarantine us from those organics. You sure that's necessary, Commander? I'd like to get a closer look. You might feel different when the slime they spew out melts through your armor plating and rots your circuits from the inside. Really? I've had some experience with organics, and believe me, nothing good can come from contact with them. Isn't that right, Optimus? Hey, what's the big idea? Sentinel Prime. Decontaminate Optimus Prime and his crew. With pleasure, sir. Those were humans, not space particles. You, Tiny, step out from behind your overgrown pal. I don't think he remembers us. And that's just how I want to keep it. This is a completely unnecessary sentinel. Can't risk an infestation, old buddy. Take it like a real bot. Cool it, Sentinel. Whatever went down between you and Optimus, you don't need to hassle his crew. No, no, no. I ain't about to provoke an intergalactic incident. I cleaned them up as best I could, sir, but you know how it is with these grease grunts. That will be all, Sentinel Prime. We've wasted enough time and valuable resources tracking down these stragglers. So if it's all the same to you, we'll just retrieve the Allspark and be on our way. Yeah, uh, about the Allspark. 
Yeah, funny story. Uh, it kind of sort of... Blew up! What? The all spark is destroyed? Not exactly destroyed, sir. More like its energy was, uh, dispersed. At least I... I think it was. Oh, you've made some big-time blunders in your day, Optimus. But this one tops them all. He's a swaggin' hero for keeping it from Megatron and the Decepticons. Stand down, Rust Bucket. Your boss is a lot of things, but Hero isn't one of them. We did a sweep of the entire planet. Not one trace of Decepticon energy signatures. That's because we kicked our sorry solenoids. You expect us to believe that a bunch of glitch detail flunkies could defeat Megatron? Why do we hide here like cowards? We should stand and fight the accursed Autobots! Patience, Lugnut. These carbon deposits shield us from detection while we recover from our last encounter with them. Besides, I have my sights set on a far bigger prize. Cybertron itself. Ooh, that sounds crazy! Even to me! How dare you doubt the word of our glorious leader? But, Master, how will you pull off this stunning victory? Two things led to our defeat in the Great Wars. The Allspark and the Autobots' exclusive space bridge technology. The Allspark, as we know, is no longer a factor. But during my battle aboard the Autobots' ship, I was able to download a schematic for one of their space bridges. Intriguing. If we reverse engineer the technology, we can construct our own space bridge. Then beam ourselves to Cybertron and conquer the planet from within. There's just one glitch. The specs are incomplete. We will need assistance filling in the gaps. And who better to assist than the master of reverse engineering, Professor Isaac Sondak. You cannot trick me into helping you this time, Megatron. The Autobots will come for me. And yet thus far, they have not. Why do you think that is? Could it have something to do with the fact that you resurrected their worst enemy? Right now, the only thing keeping you alive is your usefulness to me. I'll give you points for creativity on your bogus story, Optimus. But where's your proof? Show me one shred of evidence that the Allspark wasn't completely destroyed on your watch. You have my word. <laughs> and we all know what that's worth, don't we? Come on, boss bot. Why don't you stand up for yourself? Because he knows his place. How about I put you in your place? Ah! Okay, no. Well, easy, big guy. This cyber clown isn't worth it. Stand down, all of you! These are serious charges and they will be investigated. Optimus Prime, show us where this supposed Decepticon battle took place. Your crew will remain here with Jazz until this matter is settled. As you know, I scan some typical Earth vehicles, sir, so we won't attract attention to ourselves. Good work, Sentinel Prime. Transform! <laughs> Oh, yeah. No one's gonna notice that. Look! Prime's okay! It's all right. They're on our side. That's good, because I was worried they might, you know, destroy something. Wait! What about the others? Commander, uh, here on Earth, we drive on the right side of the street. Ultra Magnus is not interested in the opinions of a scrub. Samuel, wait! Peace.
bridge. I don't know anything about space bridges. I don't claim to know anything about it. This is not even my area of expertise. I do servo mechanics, not teleportation. No! I'm sorry. I won't complain anymore, I promise. You! You did that on purpose! To sabotage Megatron's brilliant plan! No! No, it just went crazy, I swear! No! He's telling the truth. There is a fragment of the AllSpark embedded in these circuits. The AllSpark may not have been completely destroyed. There may still be pockets of its energy scattered all over this city. All over this planet. Each one capable of instilling its life force to the most basic cybernetic construction. I thought the company's name was Sundac. Ugh, fine. I'll do it myself. With a little help from my assistant. Hmm, I wonder. Yes! Contamination located. Who are you calling a contamination? Stay cool and roll back off the ship nice and easy like. And don't even think of spewing any of your slime at me. Slime? What are you... Oh, you're afraid of me, aren't you? Booga booga booga! <gasps> What's going on out here? Guys! Stay back! You don't want to be slimed! Relax. That's just sorry. She's perfectly safe. But Sentinel... Is a glitchhead. All due respect. Crazy. These organics each have their own look, their own style. I need your help. Something's wrong at one of my dad's assembly plants. Come on! No can do. I got orders from Ultra Magnus to stick with you. Yeah, but he didn't say where. Well, I have been itching to give my new wheels a spin. <laughs> Besides, any species that could come up with a sweet ride like this can't be all bad. Ooh. Our ship is right up ahead, but try to keep quiet. Ooh, afraid there might still be some big bad Decepticons lurking in the bushes? Not Decepticons. Dinobots. <laughs> As long as you don't provoke them. I don't need some elite guard washout telling me how to handle primitive technology. That technology is not as primitive as it looks. I don't recall asking you. Fun! Shoot! Dinobots Some funky blinking colored light show. What'd you call those things again? Traffic lights. Traffic lights. Sound. That can't be good. Sound. It's no good! 
Is it always like this on this crazy planet? Pretty much. Prime, we're at the Sundak robot plant and we're gonna need backup. Copy that, Ratchet. I'm on my way. The classic Metallicato 5 Servos of Doom attack. But have you seen this one? Impressive. I guess you never got that far in your Cyber Ninja training. <laughs> If I cut in... Optimus Prime, behind you! Thanks, Commander. We should return to the ship, sir. Every moment we're out here, we risk organic contamination. It's no use! No matter how many we destroy, they just keep coming! Then we need to shut down that assembly line. I'll do it. With my key. As long as this company's name is Sumdak, it's my responsibility! Okay. Bulkhead, Ratchet, Bumblebee. Keep the drones busy out here. Prowl, you and I will sneak sorry inside to the loading dock. Mind if I join you? Why the company name is Sumdak. Autobots, disengage and retreat! Now I get why they call you Ultra Magnus. What? My key! It's stuck! I can't get it out! That panel's gonna overload! I think you've done enough, Optimus. I'll make sure you're tried for high treason for destroying the AllSpark. Now come with me! No! That wasn't a request. That's a direct order, Optimus. It's Optimus Prime. I may be an elite guard washout and a glitch detail flunky, but the last time I checked, you and I still have equal rank. So, Sentinel Prime, take your order and your condescending attitude and stick it in your hard drive. You're on my turf now. A little warning next time. What was that? Your proof. Definitely appears to be a fragment of the Allspark. Apparently, your story about dispersing it may not be so far-fetched after all. 
But sir, you can't honestly believe that. He's a lying, insubordinate crankshaft. He may be a little rough around the edges, but in the heat of battle, Optimus Prime exhibited the qualities of a true leader. Strategic thinking, determination, and above all, loyalty. Something you could stand to learn a thing or two about, Sentinel Prime? How am I gonna explain this to Mr. Powell? Hey, why is my office locked? Miss Someday. I regret to inform you that your services will no longer be required. The board has unanimously elected me to take over as CEO of Sumdac Systems. You can't do that. It's still my family's company. Is it? I took the liberty of doing some research into your claim. It might interest you to know that there is no will, no birth certificate, no adoption papers, social security number, or any kind of record whatsoever for a sorry Sumdac. Are you saying I can't prove I'm Isaac Sumdac's daughter? I'm saying you can't even prove you exist. Kaboom Heroes! Thor! At first glance, you might pass him off as another pretty superhero. What with his luxurious hair, his roguelike smile, and his fine singing voice. But when it's time for action, Thor knows how to bring down the hammer. Thor, he's awesome in action. Ha-boom!